I'm Alexa Galloway here with Coach Trendy. Coach, what do you think of the effort from the team tonight? Outstanding. I mean, I, we made an outstanding effort. And, uh, you know, hey, we had a lead going into the sixth inning. And, uh, you know, uh, both times that we scored during the course of the game, you know, they answered. Uh, you know, so I give a lot of credit to them. Uh, you know, but, but certainly I, I, I was just completely uh, impressed with the fight in our, in our guys. Uh, you know, we came in here trying to extend this thing, wanting to bring it back home. And, you know, my only concern was that they, you know, tried so hard that they wouldn't perform. But, you know, that wasn't the case. You know, we, uh, we did a lot of good things in that baseball game. And, you know, there's a couple little turns here or there and a couple of pitches that, you know, it wasn't a 10-4 baseball game, to be honest. It was, it was a game that was a lot closer than the scoreboard indicated. You know, I go back to the inning where, uh, you know, Stephen Duggar hits a line drive of the first baseman and Kevin Newman hits a ball out of the yard that's fouled by, you know, not very much. And, you know, all of a sudden that ball could have been going down the right field line and Kevin Newman's ball could have been fair, and you're looking at a whole different situation. So it was that kind of game where it kind of ebbed and flowed. And I think the big thing was every time we scored, they seemed to answer, and, you know, I give them credit for that. As a whole, what do you see from the team in the playoff run? What have I seen from the team? Uh, I think what I've seen kind of building all year long, and it just continued to kind of build, I think, into the playoffs. Uh, they really cared about each other. Uh, they really they played the game for one another. Uh, they, wanted, they wanted this thing for each other. Uh, you know, uh, I have tremendous respect for them. Uh, we, you know, we're all disappointed that it didn't have a different outcome. But uh, as I've told some other people already that have been asking me questions, I mean, you know, that disappointment is, is way overshadowed by, you know, what they accomplished as a group. And certainly it's overshadowed with me by my good fortune of being able to spend time with them this summer. Uh, you know, they, they made my day a joy. <laughs> they really did. And, you know, that's what's hard for me. I, I, to be honest with you, I hate the playoffs. And the reason I hate it is because I know it means the end of the year is coming, and it means that I'm not going to be able to spend time with these guys. And uh, you know, and, that, and that's what happens with them too. You know, and they they grew, they grew to respect each other, they grew to care about each other, and they literally grew to love each other. You know, and uh, there was there's a lot that happens in two short months. You know, that's condensed into basically kind of 24/7 days. <laughs> uh, you know, but I, I just have tremendous respect for what they accomplished, and you know, they they. Four memories are going to last a lifetime. Friendships are going to last a lifetime. And these guys are never going to forget Falmouth. You coached here for 16 years. Every team is different. But what was special about this team? I thought there was a genuine, uh, there was a humbleness. You know, you know I, I think, you know, we've had, we've been, like I said, I mean, and you said it yourself. Uh, <laughs> You know, we've had a lot of great groups. We've had a lot of very, very good baseball teams and a lot of great groups of kids. And, and every team kind of forms their own identity and leaves their own mark. And uh, this group, I thought, was just genuinely humble. Uh, you know, there was no, no, this is about me, you know, uh, thumping their chest, bragging. You know, there was none of that. You know, they just genuinely wanted to go out, play the game the right way you know, go about their day and, and uh, you know, respect the game and respect each other, which I think it should be about, uh, you know, and, and it, ne it never really became about, I mean, let's face it, a lot of these kids come here to play because they want exposure. They want to showcase themselves. It never became about that with these guys. They realized that the way to play better baseball and the way to be able to have the best summer was to play the game as a team, caring about one another, and they bought into that. And so, you know, the, the scout thing, the, you know, the outcome of a game, even all that stuff kind of became secondary. It was really just about going out, winning the next pitch, all the things that we talked about. And, uh, you know, I, I think it was, uh, you know, really about more than anything about caring about one another. And I think that's the biggest mark that they left on me was how they, they just really responded to each other. Well, thanks, Coach, for Coach Trendy. I'm Alexa Galloway. Thanks for joining us here for the last time on the Cape Cod Baseball League Network. Thanks, Alexa. Thanks, Coach.